for me, I love makeup when I don't see it. I started to work with Donald Moat. I was very impressed by his sensibility. Donald is all there for the characters. He's very subtle, very precise. Come on, old man. I think one of the most interesting things working with Denis is you kind of come to the table with sort of an open slate. You start with certain references, and I'll bring him pictures, and we sort of compare notes. So we talked about some of the things that really stood out. Obviously, the Baron. Certainly, anything to do with the main cast. We really covered each character. Certainly, with Josh's scar, it started off from less is more, but sometimes the simplest things are really difficult for people to believe. He was scarred by Dave Bautista, who if I had anybody who I would want scarring me, it would be him, because I love Dave. <laughs> never met Harkonnens before I have. They're not human, they're brutal. The Harkonnens have a clean shaved face, kind of smooth, and eyebrow blockers, which is quite a complex makeup. The makeup lends so much to the character. I mean, the first time I looked in the mirror when the makeup artist completed the look for the day, I just saw Piter. It was amazing. Uncle, how can we let this happen? How can the Emperor take everything we've built? I knew the Baron would be big, but it really is big. Arrakis is Arrakis. And the desert takes the weak. I thought of friends of mine who are based in Sweden. Luve and Eva created the whole suit. So it's a huge, huge undertaking. I had long discussions with Denis about where I wanted to go with it, and that he looked different, that he had a presence that you hadn't seen before. It was difficult because I didn't want the Baron to look like a caricature. I wanted to feel a menace of that massive human being and that weight. Kill them all. Stellan was quite frightening as the Baron, fantastic performance. We worked incredibly hard at making something that we hope people will, will like and value for kind of some artistic merit and contribution. People are hungry to see a fantastic, well-told, interesting story and I hope that they see something they didn't expect to see. I must not fear. Fear is the mind killer.